Okay, hello everyone. I'm going to want to show you my um, clock app for Mac. It's a timer stopwatch and alarm clock all wrapped up in one application. Um, since Macs do not come, out, come with a built-in clock app, this is a great alternative. Um, there, is not, there is not a Windows, well there is a Windows version actually, but it's not as advanced. Um, and I haven't made an update for it in a while. I don't, ha I don't have the ability to do that anymore because I don't have a Windows computer anymore. So yeah, there is a Windows version, but it's not being developed for any anymore. And it's not as advanced anyways. But anyways, this is for Max running um, OS X El Capitan or later. So here's the ho home tab. It gives you an overview of the timer stopwatch and alarm clock. It tells you the time down to the even to the seconds. Then it tells you upcoming alarms. You can turn off the alarm clock or enable it. Um, and then it gives you an overview of the timer. You can add a minute to it. Um, if it's you add a minute, if it's turned off, it'll automatically turn it on. Um, if it is on and there's time on it, it'll add add on to that. Um, and then stopwatch, you can uh, start it, pause it, or reset it. You can overview it right. You can view it right, right from the home tab. Timer, you can run three timers, um, all at the same time. I'm gonna see. Notice you can edit the timer. This is nice if you realized you set the timer and then realized, oh, I set it for the wrong time, or are you real? Are you need to change it for some reason, whatever that may be? This is you can just without having to reset the timer, without having to stop it and uh, creating a whole new one. You can just um, uh, you can just um, edit it. Right, um, while it's running or while it's paused, um, this is a, a nice feature. And then stopwatch. So as just like in the just like in timer, you can edit the stopwatch, add minutes or take away minutes. Just like in the iOS version, you can have laps. So then the alarm clock. Uh, you can set alarms here. You select, uh, choose the, uh, you write a, you come up with alarm title, and then it's description, optional, but you can do that. And then set the time. Choose an alarm. You can choose a different alarm for, uh, uh, not alarm, choose a different ringtone for each uh, alarm. So, yeah, choose the ringtone. You can choose, choose a different ringtone for each alarm. And then create it, and then you can edit. You can uh, select the ringtones you made in the past and delete them. From here, you can, um, Edit. Uh, you can you can change ringtones. You can create a ringtone. Um, choose a different ringtone for each um, for each timer. So three timers. You can select a different ringtone for each timer. We have um, spring. Vivaldi's Four Seasons Spring played on a harpsichord, and an old favorite here in America, Star Spangled Banner. So then steps. Um, so here are steps. Let's see. I'll put on. Five, uh, so I put on one. Steps is the amount of uh, uh, time added to added to the number when you hit plus or amount taken away when you hit the minus button. So here I'll show you. Put on five, and then it adds five to it, and then you can add or take away five. So that's a handy feature. And then timer repeat. This is convenient. You set the timer. You, you set the timer. You turn it on. The timer goes off. It ends. You hit OK, and then it repeats. It starts over again where you uh, where you set it. This is convenient if you need to be reminded so often about something. Maybe the bread in the oven. Um, need to check it every not uh, every hour or every thirty minutes. Um, so you set the timer. It goes off. You check it. You hit OK. And then it starts over again, and in 30 minutes or one hour or whatever, it reminds you again to go check on the bread in the oven. That way it doesn't burn, as an example. So yeah, that's a handy feature. So this is the alarm clock. Um, this is um, version 1.1. 1 .1. Um, the clock app, it's right now going at $2. 
It's a very handy clock app, so, so if you want a clock app, um, just take a look at the description in this YouTube video and I should have the link to it. Um, so, um, yeah, did I say this version is version 1.1? Whenever I if I come out with a new version that comes out that has a bunch of new features or stuff like that, I'll update this video so I'll make sure it's always up to date and you have the latest information about um, clock. So, anyways, thanks for watching. I um, I hope you uh, you've enjoyed it.